The suggestion from Hamilton County leaders for FC Cincinnati Stadium request use the existing stadium. Commissioners answered the $75 million question today and the answer was no. That was the amount of infrastructure money FC Cincinnati wanted from the county and the city to help build a soccer specific stadium. Joe Webb joins us live with how things move forward from here, Joe. Well, Rob, this is it. This is where Hamilton County says FC Cincinnati should play soccer here at Paul Brown Stadium. That is what they're calling their plan A. FC Cincinnati says it will not work financially and it will not fly with Major League Soccer. The clock is ticking on FC Cincinnati's deadline for their bid to join Major League Soccer, so today Hamilton County Commissioners well, met to discuss it. Just a day after the hot soccer franchise said it would pay for a new stadium if the city and county kicked in $75 million in infrastructure improvements. The stadium was not open to public discussion today, but the public discussed it anyway. They still don't have a plan, yet they want you to vote on $75 million today based on a concept that they dropped on you less than 20 hours ago. Commissioners met in private for about an hour and came out to make what Commissioner Todd Portoon called a happy and celebratory announcement. We've said for quite a while that Paul Brown Stadium uh, is the primary focus of Hamilton County in connection with addressing this need or this want, this request that has been made of us. We believe Paul Brown Stadium can work uh, under the pro forma that we have developed. We understand uh, that there is a way to make the revenue sharing and the revenue needs work. It's been his thought all along, but all along FC Cincinnati and Major League Soccer have called for a soccer specific stadium. FC Cincinnati CEO Jeff Birding said in a statement today, the county plan will not work, saying, quote, the financial data that we transparently shared with the county proves that Paul Brown Stadium would not support an MLS team, and any suggestion to the contrary is wrong. Therefore, Paul Brown Stadium simply does not work and does not result in a winning bid. It means a losing bid. Now, Hamilton County did offer up a plan B, and that's to build a 1,000-car parking garage, about a $15 million parking garage, on a potential stadium site in Oakley using parking revenues, not tax dollars, to pay for it. So, that's plan B. So, this is often referred to as the Bengals Stadium. What do the Cincinnati Bengals think about sharing this stadium with a soccer team? Well, Cincinnati Bengals spokesperson Emily Parker said this issue is between FC Cincinnati and Hamilton County. She said the Bengals have not been involved in any of the discussions. Rob? Joe Webb, thanks very much. Major League Soccer has said it will grant two cities new franchises this year with a decision expected after an owner's meeting on December 14th.